Hey everyone, it's Beastspell81 again, and time for the next video. In this video, we'll be doing my Frozen collection and my Beauty and the Beast Curio, and honestly, that'll probably be about what we can cover in this one. So let's get started. So this is my Frozen collection up here. Some of you may remember from pictures before that I originally had my Frozen collection in that little cubby right there on the top but it just started to outgrow that section. So I went ahead and moved it over here on top of the curio. So we have my Disney Store Hans doll and a little mini Hans from the mini Mattel set. I actually purchased the set to use for um, oldest gal's birthday cake and there were some extras. She just wanted Kristoff, Anna and Sven on her cake. So I got to keep the extras. This is my Frozen Party Cup. It has Anna on one side and Elsa on the other. And then inside of that cup I also have a little cup I got at Walmart. I have a Disney Store Anna still in the box that I ordered during the last one of the last restocks. Um, she's my favorite character from Frozen and so I wanted to have one in the box. And then I've got my Frozen Valentines and stickers and a Frozen read-along book. Here are my Anna and Elsa classic dolls from the Disney Store. And then over here we have Minnie Elsa and Olaf from that same mini set. Oh, that is not focusing. Sorry, it's deciding to focus on something else. Anyway, um, they're also from the mini set with Hans. And we've got a Frozen mini coloring book. And my Disney Animator Collection Kristoff here and Toddler Anna there. And then my classic Kristoff doll. And in the back there's a little frozen plate that goes with the pink cup. So that's my frozen collection. There are a few things I would love to add eventually if possible, but honestly considering how crazy the stock has been and how it's so hard to find stuff, I'm just so thankful for what I have. So. It would be fun to get the little mini dolls from the Disney store, and I would love to get the deluxe set. And basically, I just want the Elsa and Anna dolls and then just sell the excess stuff. Um, but anyway, we'll see. So this is my curio, and it does have a mirror in the back, so I'm going to try and go ahead and give you, you guys a tour of that without showing my face since I'm trying to remain anonymous. So we'll see how that goes. So this opens up. This is a curio I bought before I was married. It was one of my first big furniture purchases. Um, it used to house my... It used to have, I think, my Boyd's Bears in it, and now it has my Beauty and the Beast stuff. So this first shelf... Ooh, there's my hand. <laughs> this first shelf has just some of my toys and things. These are my Beauty and the Beast Pizza Hut puppets from the 90s. Um... Beauty and Beast Little People and Squinkies, and then um, a Squinky set that's still in the box. And then um, this is a vintage Beauty and the Beast locket I found at Goodwill. A little plush beast, the dancing princess mini doll, mini bell doll from Mattel. A Funko Pop beast. Um, this is a set of Beauty and the Beast collector cards still sealed in the box from the 90s or so. And some of you may remember in one of my blog posts on one of my trips I found this at a Goodwill. It's a complete set of the collector cards in a little thing. I found it for three bucks which was really exciting. And I have a party cup and a little mini squinky set still in the package. So now we'll go down here. Oop, there's part of me. <laughs> um, this is my Beauty and the Beast Disney Store musical snow globe that I absolutely love. I bought this on a trip to Seattle um, when I when my aunt used to live there. We went and visited and that was my souvenir. And here's a Beauty and the Beast film strip and a little display thing. Um, we have some different ornaments and small things here. This um, 3D plate and this music box of Belle in the pink dress were presents from my husband. He bought them for me um, on one of our trips. Well, no, actually, I guess one of our trips when we were in college and we were in a music group, we went to a store that had them and I loved them, but I didn't buy them then, so he ordered them for me later. 
And then um, this music box is from my mom and dad. I got it for Christmas one year. These two are made by the same company. It's Schmid, I think is how you say it. It's C-H, no, S-C-H-M-I-D. Um, they have some absolutely beautiful pieces. And then just some little things I'm going to go in a little closer. I hope this is focusing. My camera does not always like to focus. But just give you a little tour of the shelf so you can have a closer look. And I realize I should probably do that with the top shelf too. So we'll do that just really quick before we move on. Without showing me, hopefully. It's really tricky with this mirror. I might have to do this whole thing again when I go back and see the video. Okay, so ooh, hopefully I'm not making you seasick. So here is the next shelf. This shelf has um, my Disney Store classic dolls. Um, Belle from 2010, Belle from 2011, Belle from 2012, and 2013 Belle is way in the back. And then I have a few of my Beast dolls. This is Royal Style Beast Prince doll and the Disney Store version. And a John Smith back here who um, I thought might kind of work for that. Sorry, it's so dark down here. I guess I should have grabbed the lamp. Um, I've got a collector plate I found on Craigslist, a couple more of those film strips in their collectible um, packaging, the Walt Disney Classics Collection film title and Lumiere, a uh, snow globe here that my husband got for me on my birthday. I think that was another one before we were married, but I don't remember. We might have been married at that point. It's all getting a little hazy. It'll be 12 years this summer, so, you know. And this here is kind of hard to see in this back corner. Let me see if I can move this bell here. This is a uh, bell jar, not just B-E-L-L -L jar, with a wooden rose. And this is actually, this was my ring box that had my engagement ring in it that my husband um, made with my dad and then brought to our family home. It's got a really sweet little rose box in it. Ugh, come on, Bell, stand up. Here we go. Ooh, stay. It's got a little rose box in it. Nope, you didn't stay. That um, held the ring. It's kind of hard to see. Sometime I'll have to show you guys that in more detail. And then this bottom shelf has a lot more of my toys and things. I'm sorry, it's kind of dark. But it has um, like Burger King toys from the 90s and a bunch of the little applause figures and the bendy figures, and these two dolls are my original Beauty and the Beast dolls I got when I was a little girl. So just some fun little random things in there. And I'm gonna bring this up this way and go ahead and close the doors now. Oops, preview of the My Little Pony shelf there. So um, this, the two, or I have the two um, bell ornaments hanging on the front. Um, so yeah, this is just a really fun place to display. I've been collecting Beauty and the Beast stuff since I was in college, so a lot of this is stuff that I had even before I was married. So it's always really fun to look back and see those things. Um, I don't think I'm going to have time to go over anything else right now, although I think we'll skip over, yeah, I've got just enough time. I'll skip over to the smaller shelf and then I'll come back in my last video and do the white shelves here. So let's come over this way. Once again, pardon the glare of the lamp. I'm gonna move it out of the way a little bit. So this shelf is by my bed. Um, so we've got my, uh, these are all my Beauty and the Beast books, Beauty and the Beast related books. Um, some of them are different versions, some of them are Disney versions, but I've collected those for as long as I can remember. Um, these are my dolls from India, Barbie dolls from India, both found at Goodwill. And up here we have my Nancy Ann storybook dolls. So I'm starting to branch into antiques too. Part of that is being in my um, local doll club that I joined. But these were given to me by a woman in my church who didn't need them and wondered if I wanted them. And some more books. And then on the very top here, this is pretty much the same as the last video. We have four of my boxed Bell dolls. There's a uh, Holiday Princess Bell. Special Sparkles Bell, Broadway Bell, and Deluxe Bell from the Disney Store. Each of these are some of my very favorite 
bell dolls. They're very fancy and I just really love them. Okay, so that's all for this video. I'm going to run out of um, memory card if I go any longer, so I'm going to back up slowly and give you a quick preview of what is coming next, which is my white shelf here, which I just love. So I'll see you guys in the next video.